I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm gonna leave this in for about 10 minutes. 10 minutes, counting down. Everybody thinks, oh, I need to add more product. It's so frizzy, I need more gel. For you guys to show you what it looks like when I put my products in. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I typically do not um, detangle my hair and wash my hair on the same day. It just becomes a little bit too much. And by the time I'm ready to style my hair, I'm totally over it, which leads me to be very rough with my hair, leads to breakage. So for me and my style and my routine, I will detangle my hair the day before. It's usually at night before I go to bed. And then when I wake up in the morning, I just jump in the shower and I wash my hair. So yeah, that's just full disclosure. So now that my hair is fully detangled, I'm gonna go in and start with my treatment. This particular treatment is from Olaplex. It is the step three treatment. All right, so I already did this section here. What you wanna do is you wanna make sure your hair is damp. So I'm just gonna wet my section down. I'm going to get it out. Sure, I'm getting to my roots and like that to the ends of my hair. And then I will twist this up. Okay, so I'm all done. I'm gonna leave this in for about 10 minutes. 10 minutes, counting down. Okay, so these are the products that I'm going to be using. Um, everything is pretty much from pattern except for one thing. So I have my hydration, my hydrating shampoo, heavy conditioner. After that, this gets rinsed out, and then I go in with a leave-in conditioner and my styling product as well, which is the gel. In between the gel and the leave-in conditioner, sometimes I will put in a curling plumper. I'm gonna go wash my hair, and I will see you guys when I'm done. This is typically what my hair looks like when I'm done washing the hair. See how much it wants to spring up already? Alright, I'm going to start with my leave-in conditioner. Sorry about the sun coming in like this. This is crazy. I didn't expect this to happen. So that was my conditioner. I'm gonna go in. This is my best friend. You can still see that there's like frizz. See the frizz? Some of them curled up pretty nicely. Curled up pretty nicely with just a conditioner. You see that? So then you have like this frizz pocket here. So I'm gonna go in with my primer. Not that much. That's what it looks like. I'm gonna run this through, I'm gonna massage this into the hair. And you can see it wants to clump up a little better. Less first. Okay. Now I gotta take a smaller section. And we're gonna style this section now. So when it comes to styling my wash and go, water, I would say, is your best friend. Everybody thinks, oh, I need to add more product. It's so frizzy, I need more gel. Nope, I added my product and then I added water. And look at the clumps, beautiful. That's what you wanna see. All right, I'm gonna do it again. So I already put my other two products. Now it's just applying gel. In sections, massage it in, pull those curls down, add your water, and you can either do a shingling method like so, just taking one curl at a time, or you can do a brush. Up and 
do what they're doing. I'm gonna kind of shingle these curls. For you guys to show you what it looks like when I put my products in and I style and everything. So the back is this back section is done and this section is straight out of the shower and dry with no conditioner so first thing I'm gonna do is spray always keep a water bottle near you it's going to definitely help your life I add my leave-in conditioner Start from the ends and work my way up to the root. Massage that in really good. Use my brush to detangle. I start at the ends and I work my way up. I don't move up until this section is nicely detangled. Spray it a little more. And then I'm going to start to add my gel, okay? Now. Okay guys, so I just wanted to show you what my hair looks like after all the product is applied. This is my hair wet. This is what it looks like when it's wet and I usually will just let this sit for a while because it just takes so long to wash shampoo conditioner treatment blah 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 at that point I don't even feel like drying my hair so I'm just gonna get like something to eat because I'm usually like starving after I'm done with my hair which I'm hungry right now I'll let it sit for like an hour or so and whenever I'm not tired of my hair then I'll just pick up my dryer and I'll dry it I'll show you guys what that looks like when it's dry. And this is what my after looks like. I'm so excited for my bouncy curls. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.